It might just drop off into a hole. Uh, okay, no. This Bye, is bye awesome. base camp. This is all. There it okay, goes. Yeah. This is a bad oh idea. God. This is what really. Just oh, look, 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 look down here. Look down here. Oh, there's a hole. So look at that. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> oh my gosh. There it, is. it might be stuck. I think this is a really stupid idea. Okay, I think I can recover it from the other side if it can go through. I doubt it. I am not crawling in here to get this. this Someone's is... gonna have to. Yeah, it's not gonna be me, and it's not gonna be you. Stop! This is really dumb. Okay, let me see if I can find a big stick. All right, Nate found his stick. Oh, okay, I don't know. This was not a <laughs> Just great don't idea. fall down. No, I'm okay. Like, I can get the You're truck. You're it from the bottom. Yeah. <laughs> the stick might break because the base camp's a heavy old thing. Okay. Um, our base can camp it? may live here for the rest of its life. It might. <laughs> Stop! This no, is on. what bad no. Indians no, are made of. No. Oh yep. my gosh. Oh, this is so cool. The base camp by Axial is actually one of my favorite all-time crawlers, mainly for the price and for the sheer fact that it is a pickup truck. Now, Axial has a brand new version of the base camp with tons of extra scale, details, and accessories. And I love that because if the base camp was lacking in one thing, it was attention to detail. The price point shined, and the idea behind the base camp is a base platform vehicle for everyone to start with, ready to run from the ground up and build onto it if you wanted to. Now, the really cool thing is the old base camp was $300. The newest version now, this base camp, is only 20 more dollars and it comes with an exceptional amount of extra scale details. I love just the overall look, like all the stickers and things on it, but then we have like the bars on the back, all these little extra details and accessories and actually usable accessories. These come off if you get stuck in the mud. You can put those down and dig yourself out of the mud. So that's really cool. And of course, we have our candy box on the back here, as I like to call it. We put our candy in there. If you need a mint while on the trail, well, you've got one and it doesn't take up any pocket space. So that is very cool. And hopefully you guys will have noticed we're here with our family. So you might hear children in the background today and that's okay because we're having some fun together today as a family. Uh, and we're here at a very cool cave. So let's have some fun with the new version of the base camp and see what this thing is capable of while crawling around in a cave. Hashtag what's in the tarp. <laughs> what could it be? I don't know. It does look awfully suspicious. <laughs> I mean, personally, this is like the best looking axial in my opinion, because I love the base camp. I love a pickup style body. Battery placement is awesome. Did I mention this runs on a 2S or 3S battery? High performance vehicle. Oh yeah, look at that, that's nice. If you're unaware too, uh, a lot of times the reason you have a secondary pack location like this is for a smaller battery to power things like lights separately. And the nice thing about the new base camp is it comes with a five channel receiver. So we have a lot of options to be able to plug things in and run lights or winches or smoke machines or whatever you, whatever you might like to do. <laughs> Oh, you're taking them off. That's okay. Oh, no. It's actually just around the standoff, so no big deal. I matched the truck today. I did too. I was very gray. Yeah, so that's a 3S battery. Be aware that you should have all the power in the world if you need it. Man, we are at a very cool spot, you guys, with a lot of crawling options and potential. That little wall there looks re really cool. But I am really in love with this thing. I loved the base camp. I didn't think they did anything wrong with it. But yeah, sure, it was, I guess you could say, a little bit basic. But now we've got this upgraded version, this updated version. It's only 20 more dollars. And I don't know if you guys caught this or not, but if you're watching this video on the day of release today, then the base camp old version i noticed it was 70 dollars off so i think i think 250 or something like that I don't think I can do that. oh abby wants to drive it through this little hole in the rock down here 
Yeah, the leaves are gonna make it very hard to drive. Very slick on the rocks. Oh, she's scratching up my paint. You did it though. Hey, the base camp is a very, and there's portal axles on this, so that clearance. Look at that, look at that. Oh, it's so cool. No, Abby, there's no, you can't do it. But the 24th scale could. Do you guys see the new pink 24th scale? That would fit under there. See, that's what I'm talking about, having different driving options. Oh my gosh, what way do I go? I would reverse and then try again. Oh, this is gonna be fun. This is such a cool spot. Oh no, that's one. Oh, no, oh, no, nah, you're stuck. That's one. Let's take it up to the new spot that I would like to try. Looks amazing. Cool truck, right, Abby? Yeah. Like, I really like it. Axial with their base camp is home run and a half. Give it full throttle, just punch it real fast. So you guys can keep up on trails with that speed and it slows down really nicely too. I wonder if it can climb. This is a, this is like the crawler's paradise. This is amazing. Look at this. Let's get in tight. Wow. I don't know if I can even climb this wall. So you went up there on the dirt path. There's a nice rocky path. Oh, look at that. That is so cool, Abby. <laughs> Hit the rocks, girl. Get some actual traction. Oh, look at that hop. Oh no, that's gonna be two. Wipe out. This is cool. I love this spot. It is steep. It's a really good test of crawler capabilities. I, this might be the new standard rather than Bash Mountain for crawlers. We might have Crawler Cave. Oh, this is Crawler Cave. Crawler Cave. Oh, I love it. And the new base camp is helping us break in Crawler Cave. I mean, this just feels right. This is cool. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I got it. I can do it. I, I'm confident I can climb this. Which way do I go? Left to get through that and then, oh. yeah, if, if she rolls it, it's my turn. It's my turn. It's my turn. Okay, you saved it. I'll let you go one more. But if you roll again, it's my turn. Oh, she's done. She's done. Oh, you're going to bust my new, duh, my truck. Okay, my turn. Girl, let's see if I can get this. It's harder than it looks, Nate. Harder than it looks. No, I got this. I'm going straight wrong. Oh, okay. <laughs> how to taste, taste it? It is on a hundred throttle, just so you know. Yeah, okay, so a little sense of the throttle. Yeah. New location, very slick, dry leaves. You gotta, you gotta give us a little credit here. We've never driven this spot before. There we go. See, that's what we needed. We needed to hit that track. Oh my gosh, Nate has it's gotten hard. higher than me. Okay, so it's still hard with the loose dirt there. But if we can uh -oh. keep it... No. Whoa. If we can keep it on track on the rocks, then we got it. And that's, see, now we're easy mode. Now let's hit this giant... Look at that rock. That is like perfect for crawling. Look at this. This is amazing. I love this. Oh, okay. Hop it, hop it, hop it. No, 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 no. no, no. no. <laughs> you almost no, saved no, it. <laughs> Just for some perspective, you guys, let me go back to the bottom of this hill. So you can get a size reference. Like, that's pretty steep. This is what makes crawling fun. This, the challenge, the challenge of it, man, that just makes it next level. Our por portal axes are helping big time on that clearance, you know? I don't know if I can climb that specific spot, so let's try a different route. Keep the throttle up, because we're slick here. Yeah, we're gonna conquer Crawler Cave. We sunk in right there, that's really soft <laughs> sand. It's almost oh, dust. You're kicking it. Oh, I'm digging in the back end. Go left. I'm going. I got, see, oh I lost the momentum. It helps to keep the momentum. Yeah, that back end is digging in. As soon as I veer off course, I got to go off the left side and oh. then hold the top end. There you go, there you go. And there punch go, through there that. There we go. Look nice. at that. Nice. That's Conquered. Amazing. Crawler Cave is awesome. Now we can come down this for sure. Let's just try not to roll it. This is such a cool spot. Oh. 
<laughs> oh no! I should maintain throttle! No! Throttle! 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 Oh. I wanted to try another spot up there on the rocks, but gravity's telling us to explore down here. So let's try the other side because I think, Abby, there's a secret tunnel on the other side. I think this truck can actually fit through it. So let's tr try to drive up there as far as we can and see if it can actually make it through the tunnel. Okay, this is crazy. You ready? More like a ledge. <laughs> okay, so can you, I... can you maybe see it? Like if you angle this down, you can see that, right? <laughs> I don't know. It might just drop off into a hole. Uh, okay, no. This bye is bye, awesome. base camp. This is all. There it okay, goes. Okay, yeah. This is a bad oh idea. God. This is what really. Oh, look, 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 look down here. Look down here. Oh, there's a hole. Yeah, look at that. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> It might be stuck. I think this is a really stupid idea. Okay, I think I can recover from the other side if it can go through. I doubt it. I am not crawling in here to get this. this Someone's is... gonna have to. Yeah, it's not gonna be me and it's not gonna be you. Stop, this is really dumb. Okay, let me see if I can find a big stick. All right, Nate found his stick. Oh, okay, I don't know. This was not a <laughs> good idea. Just don't fall down. No, I'm okay. Like I can get the You're truck. hooking it from the butt. Yeah. <laughs> the stick might break because the base camp's a heavy old thing. Okay. Um, our base can camp it? may live here for the rest of its life. It might. <laughs> Stop. No, this is on. what bad no. Indians no, are made of. No. Oh yep. my gosh. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> oh. yeah. This is awesome in here. <laughs> This is so cool. It's such a crawler's paradise. It's amazing. Oh, oh that's awesome. Don't fall on the stick. Here. Here, move so I can try to... Yeah. I just... Here's that. Nate says it opens to the other no, side. You see Where? the sunlight over there? No. I can. Yeah, it pokes through. It goes out there. I think a crawler with an FPV camera see could do it. Light. I promise. There's light down there's there. No, it goes through. There's no way that an would fit there. An FPV drone. We can do it. No. We have to come back. <laughs> You're crazy. <laughs> okay, because of the base camp new version, we have explored a new spot, had new fun adventures, and will have many more fun adventures with our family, with this area, areas like this, because of this truck. This is why I like axial or crawlers in general. To those of you that are like, you know, airplanes are more fun, I would totally agree on like a normal daily basis. I love flying airplanes, it's more exciting, but this gets us out in nature and exploring new things like this. Crazy adventures that I would not have done with an airplane, right? This is a cool truck. I love the base camp and now they have an updated version of what is already awesome. And I didn't see that coming because the base camp isn't that old, but this is super cool and I'm glad it exists. It also comes in another color. So if you don't love this one, which I do, it's holding up really well to the beating that both of us have thrown at it. There's another color linked in the description box below. Know that using that link does help to support our channel and our family at no extra cost to you. And we're super grateful to those of you that do think to support us. It means the world to us. So thank you guys from the bottom of our hearts. On the subject of gratitude, I wanna say a massive thanks to God for blessing us with this experience and this time to share in front of the camera with you guys and exploring this really awesome part of nature. It's super cool and I just say a big thanks to God for life in general. Last but certainly not least, I wanna say a huge thanks to our Patreon supporters because we couldn't do what we do as often as we do it without your insanely awesome support. Guys, we'll have the original base camp video that we did, which was a huge blast popping up right about now. Thanks for watching. We'll see you there.